So let's just let's just count <laughs> let's just start it. No no tricks in the first match. Let's get it going. Oh shit. Three, two, one, Tetris. Best of luck to both players. Let's get it going. <clears throat> <clears throat> Uh, how can a sofa be salted? Ah, yes, the age-old question. Uh, one that myself and many scholars have yet to find the answer to. Uh, but I am making it my life's mission to answer that question. Alright. Matt Martin on the left. White monster on the right. Uh, Matt's sort of got like a wobbly... Uh, Gameplay going on, I maybe mean, some uh, loose connections with the NES. Nonetheless, we can see the blocks, we can see the Tetrises, that's all we need to know and see. Matt, uh, being a little ferocious there with the squares, building a little spire, but uh, you know it's going to navigate it like a champion. And bang down a Tetris. 50,000 points for the Dasser, 91,000 for the Shucks, I don't actually know. What playstyle is White Monster? Thank you for the 321 bits, Yvonne. Much, much appreciated. Thank you for your support. Thank you for your support. Matt is playing Das, so White Monster has a chance, says Alephius. Hey, no one has a chance when they're up against Matt. Well, let's just say that. I'm fitting page. <laughs> oh, God, Matt is in. Matt is not looking good. Oh, no, Matt Martin hangs the long bar. No, 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 I have jinxed it. An early top up from Matt gives White Monster game number one. I don't quite know what happened. The row three gambling uh, took a turn for the worse. And, um, well, we're just gonna move right along. Forget that even happened, I may add. Three, two, one, Tetris. Look at that. Look how fast I typed Tetris there. You guys didn't even know. It was so seamless. Ban for spam. No, please. It wasn't spam, I promise. I simply counted down game. Okay, no, seriously. What, what, what playstyle is? <clears throat> what what playstyle is, is, is my monster? Um, I actually don't even know... Oh, it's zero? Okay, yeah, white monster zero. Ah, Chicky Tapper. Yes, yes, he is a tapper from Poland, indeed. Indeed, Arino. Das versus Tap, the classic rivalry. Who will prevail? Let's find out. Matt has a bit of a uh, sloped left side, fills it with some squares, and is now building it with some squares. Very nice. Continuing with the squares. Oh, God, lots of squares. Oh, God. Oh, dear God. Oh, dear God, the squares. The squares! Matt Martin is done at 47,000 the squares. That is what I've, I've been saying this since since the birth of Tetris. Squares are the worst piece in the game. No one can change my mind on that. Best of luck. Here we go. Um, <laughs> game number one. Um, let's do it. Let's do it. Starting from three, two, one, go. Let's get it going. Both starting with TP says, here we go. <clears throat> Warm up done twice. Yes. Precisely. Alright. White monster. Taking a bit of burns in the early goings of the match. <laughs> Hana saying, where was this in my match? Yep, we all know that <laughs> feeling of getting slaughtered by an opponent and then... Uh, Early topping out and then following match. That's NES Tetris, you know what I mean? That is the game. It's a Tetris for Matt, bringing them to 70,000 points. White Monster at 50,000 with that Tetris, both with the. Well, I would say White Monster has the nicer stack here. Uh, Matt unable to get the bar in column, um, column one. Um, however, gets it now and yeah, has to kind of plug the hole a little bit with that untimely S piece. Holds off of the bar, gets the bar, and is going to do a nice T tuck. How is Matt going to navigate this uh, little predicament here? Has a hole in yeah, row three. So, probably going to need to use a bar to bring things down. And again, boogie on um, row four. Or not. That's okay. 
playing it a bit safe. Can't blame him. Meanwhile, White Monster is uh, continuing to skim uh, and take a Tetris lead there at 33 lines. Oh yeah, predictions are still going on, true. Um, uh, uh, I don't know how. Wait. Can I, like, end it early? I don't actually know if you can end predictions early, can you? Does anyone know how? I, I simply cannot end the prediction because then I will have to choose a winner. And of course there is no winner yet. <clears throat> Any of the mods in chat know how to do that? If that's possible, can help me out, that'd be great. <clears throat> Touches from Matt Martin. Um, White Monster going to slam down a Tetris. 245,000 points, which is about 12,000 points ahead of Matt, who is doing very nice. Uh, going to probably burn that double with the SPCS and bang down the Tetris. <coughs> looking good. Both players looking super clean. Super clean like Mr. Clean Magic Eraser. Anyone ever use that? I will say it is as advertised. I'm not going to lie. It's pretty magical. If there was something that you could attribute to a magic eraser, it would be that product from Mr. Clean. Valid advertising, may I say. Alright, thank you, Zempro, for closing the prediction. I, yeah. Yeah, thanks. How did you do that, by the way, just for so I know in the future? How did you end it early? Both players slamming down Tetris's score pretty much unchanged. One Tetris lead for Matt there. <clears throat> White Monster gonna fill in that little dependency with the SP, is so looking good. Nice and flat. Got some room to burn, gonna probably fill Column Man with the L, does so. And yeah, pieces are doing doing White Monster pretty pretty good. Pretty well, I would say. Some friendly RNG there for White Monster. Uh in contrast. The previous games there for Matt. Uh, Matt's gonna force the Lombard dependency. Fortunately, gets the bar to fill it out because we all know what an uh, unfilled Lombard dependency can result in if left untreated. Safety triple there for Matt. He's gonna bang down the Tetris, bringing to 430,000 points in the lead by one Tetris. While White Monster gonna have to do some cleanup here. So this is the chance for Matt to come back a little bit. Uh, unfortunately, covers the well at the wrong time, but he's playing safe and conservative the way he needs to at the moment. Gets the Tetris. Now 30,000 in the lead. <clears throat> Any dependency fillers, says Milchuk? Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, White Monster in a bit of trouble there. Not sure what happened with the L piece. That is looking a little like, what the heck, you know what I mean? Um, yeah, White Monster in a bit of a, a bit of a danger here. Kind of high up. Let's see what can happen. Going to have to do... Oh, boy, this is really trouble. Can to get the bar all the way over? Doesn't get the bar over. White Monster is going to be done at 437. So the reverse sweep is on the cars. Matt Martin, one foot in the door. And we have a game. We have a game on our hands here. Anyways, <clears throat> uh, yeah, both players are ready. Let's count it down from five, four, three, two, one, Tetris. Or in my case of spamming the keyboard, Tetris. Tetris. Kingsman and Yaventi, Javanti, welcome into the chat. Alliteration. Yes, we all know alliteration, you know. Matt Martin, Salted Sofa, both very nice uses of alliteration. <laughs> oh, nice burn there from Matt. Love that. Love an L piece. 
love an LP, so just slide right in the middle there. I'm gonna have to use a long bar, and of course the L comes now needs a J. Oh, that's a nice S spin. Doesn't use the bar for the J dependency, rather clears that line, which not sure was the ideal scenario. Nonetheless, fills it out, gets the T spin, and is gonna bang down a Tetris. Haha, <laughs> see I predicted it. Boom! There it is. <clears throat> 91,004 White Monster. 72,004 Matt Martin. Powered by Game Spy. Welcome into the chat. Uh, and Pooh as well. Welcome in. No matter what new Future Circuit winner this stream, well, that is a very fun fact. Thank you, Hana, for the input. Um, I thought Matt won Futures before. I guess not. Well, that's cool. Uh, regardless of who wins, there will be a, a new a new Discord role uh, uh, acquired. So there you go. There you go. Touch for Matt. White Monster waiting for his Tetris. We'll love a square to the left side. We'll get a square to the left side to fill that out nicely and slam down that four-line clear with the long boy. Nice sequence there for the J and L. Gonna fill out the left. Okay, he doesn't quite get the right timing of the pieces there. Nonetheless, gets a following bar. White Monster, 170. About 5,000 points ahead of Matt, who is in need of some pieces. Nice dash control, look at that. Shakes his head, it was a bit monk s but the pieces along with that splendid dash control grants him the escape. And um, also a missed S spin, but... He is still in the lead. <clears throat> I gotta clear my throat, man. What is going on back there? Matt going for some column. Nine Tetris action. Gonna get the perfect well transfer. Nice adjustment there for the LP. So where is the bar for the perfect well transfer? Give it to us. We want the perfect well transfer. Where is it? There it is. Yes. Oh, baby. Nothing like a well transfer. Perfect well transfer, you know what I mean? There's nothing quite like it. If I had to think of something that was similar to the well transfer in terms of satisfying um, plays, it would have to be maybe sliding a long bar into a long bar dependency perfectly. Like if it was four deep and it was flat all around, sliding that long bar in to fill that dependency, that is also extremely satisfying. Um, just some of the great things that can occur while playing against Tetris to counteract the brutal RNG. All right. White Monster has taken up a lead of about 50,000 points. And uh, shows no sign of slowing down White Monster needing to clear that one line. Does so with the Lombar in column nine and his touch is ready. Look at that beautiful board from White Monster. Absolutely gorgeous. Keeping that column nine slightly below the rest of the stack to afford him some burns if needed, but also <clears throat> Tetris readiness. Neck and neck, says, Gal oh, no, says Galaxy Biscuit. Is it really a no burn well transfer if it gives you an eight high double well? That is a very, very good point, Enpu. Definitely not as satisfying um, as if it, like, if you were doing some dirty Tetrises and you got that perfect well transfer to clear out the dirty, the dirty lines and bring you back to the right side. So there was definitely some, um, should I say, limitations to that uh, perfect well transfer that made it not as satisfying as it could be. Uh, you are totally right. All right, both players approaching the transition in less than 30 lines. Both players with pretty nice boards. Nice J tuck there for Matt. That could have caused some unwanted burns before the speed switch. Oh boy, that is some high stacking. Matt knows it too. That, that little head shake, that little head twirl, you could say, it says it all. Many emotions from Matt's side and uh, quite. <clears throat> Quite the same emotions from White Monster's side. He has been jiving this entire time. Jiving like there's no tomorrow. Jiving like his life depended on it in that very suave attire. 
Transition approaching in two lines for White Monster. Both players are going to look to get some nice transitions here. Not have their board be in shambles. Matt Martin's game is on the line here, so we'll see how he can balance that. And it unfortunately has to cover the well before the transition, but he can get a T-piece. There's the T-piece. Gets the square over barely. Oh boy, there's going to be... It's going to be a bit tricky, but definitely manageable. <clears throat> needs an Ella J. Going to use the long bar. Matt Martin probably going to survive this. Now needs a bar to slam down the Tetris. Doesn't get it in time, and it's going to have to continue to burn. Meanwhile, White Monster has been stacking. Oh, boy. And covers the well when the bar comes. Matt Martin not getting well-timed pieces. Needs a bar. Needs a bar. Can he get it over? Matt can't get the bar over. The RNG sequence was brutal. On that transition, just poor timing on all of the pieces and the bars. Ah, it's brutal. Just brutal. If some of those pieces came even one piece later or earlier, could have done something about it. But nonetheless, White Monster in the lead with that Tetris. At 600,000 point, we'll take game number four and win Future Circuit May 2023. Congratulations to you, White Monster. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Um, how do we? Ah, oh, there you go. Ba -ba -ba -ba. He's still dancing. He does not get tired. There you go, White Monster. Congratulations, you have won the tournament, and you have uh, booked your ticket into Challenger Circuit. You have acquired the discord role in the ctm discord congratulations to you bit of a tough set there for matt martin but it is how the cookie crumbles as you can say it's how the tetraminos fall that is aneas tetris hey everybody this is your old pal van dweller host of classic tetris monthly and i'm asking you to do me a favor if you like this video Hit thumbs up. If you want to see more videos like it, please subscribe and bang that notification bell. Join our Discord server, the largest classic Tetris community online at ctm.gg slash discord. And follow us on Twitch at twitch.tv slash monthly Tetris. Thank you and have a nice day.